The doctor finally let her pilot the TARDIS, which led her to pilot it to Chimbley's base. On her second attempt, she piloted it to a mysterious mansion, where she ended up being trapped in its library. She was charged with breaking the law and sent for trial. She then helped the doctor investigate what was happening on a spaceship near Earth. After traveling with Glitz, Mel ended up on the run from his criminal associates. She was reunited with the doctor and Ace on Ricosta and joined them on their travels. They accidentally visited Spain during the Spanish Civil War, where she encountered the sexism of the time. She helped to discover the effects of a god seed. The doctor later took her the planet Prosper, where she got separated from the doctor. She worked out that it was the drugs the Megara took that caused them to mutate. They later went to parking where she was arrested. She used her knowledge of explosives to lure out of the free parkers. This attracted Dunn to her. She had to convince the free parkers and the tribe of the lost that something was causing that fight against the wardens. They later went to Liverpool where she discovered that Vinnie Gillespie was an alien. She was kidnapped by him. She went to stop the building of the ship but couldn't stop it, and consequently couldn't stop the sacrifice of Lee Clayton. She tried to pilot the TARDIS but it didn't respond. She found it exciting using a hologram to defeat the Orgem. Ace told Mel that the doctor had changed their course because he wanted to deal with some unfinished business, and warned her when the doctor was in this state. They went the Silurian capital city, China and America, in 2085. She learned that the Silurians wanted to provoke a nuclear war and was worried about the doctor's motives. She went to stop both Bart Falco and Shen not knowing which was under the control of the Silurians. Ace was left in an alternative Berlin in 1961 by the doctor, where she encountered Tom Elliott. She tried to help him but eventually he escaped from her. She realized that the timeline they were in was collapsing. She had to cross the Bielan Wall to give the photos she needed to stop the bomb. Later she helped in defeating the Archilax. Mel knocked Ace and the Doctor out and brought the TARDIS to Josiah W. Dogbolter, as contracted under duress. Using a quantum possibility engine, Dogbolter created a future wherein he was President and Ace, the Doctor and Narvin were written into different lives. She was a police officer in this life. After Dogbolter's interference was unwritten and the TARDIS returned to the Doctor, Ace, while still furious with Mel and declaring that she'd need to earn her trust back, decided to give her another chance as she was sure that she would try.